what is up what's up what is up fs club welcome back to the channel and welcome to a new let's play series finally got it this is construction simulator that will be coming out to playstation xbox and pc very soon i am actually on the playstation 5 showing this off i think it actually comes out the 20th Anyways, if you guys do like this video, a like would be appreciated. If we get over 150 likes on this video, I'll have the next episode out tomorrow. Okay, but anyways, let's get into this. Hopefully, I got the music and everything all set right. Haven't actually did a video from console in a long time. All right, let's go to start. I think I got everything all right. Okay, start. Okay, so create a new profile to start your career. Okay, let's click that. Oh, you can actually select your in-game character. Um, let's see, we got you. The thing that's weird is you can't actually use your D-pad when you're selecting this. I'm actually using my joystick. Um, uh, maybe you. Let's uh look over. Um huh. I think that actually the second one. So let's click on you. Oh, you can actually change the appearance and everything? That's nice. All right, let's um Okay, but then with the selections, you can actually use the D-pad. Okay, so, um, can I zoom out? Oh, that's to go back. Um, I don't think you can zoom out. Uh, let's just keep that red. Uh, of course, this probably is going to be yellow, if I can find yellow. There it is. Okay, helmets, you can actually change that. Oh, can you? Actually, I don't think you can change it. Hearing protection. Um, let's do that one. Glasses. Those. And decals. Oh, so you can actually put some decals. <laughs> Look at that. Get to work. Um, there's not really many decals, though. Um, let's just keep it simple. Just a yellow hat. Okay, uh, let's go ahead. What do you click X? Okay, player's name. Um, just go with my original name, I guess. There we go. Okay. Okay, start your own game. Prove your skills as a construction professional and show what you are made of. Let your friends or other players join your game when you complete the opening campaign. Oh, so you actually got to complete the opening campaign before you do a multiplayer game. And then you got to join a multiplayer game instantly and support your friends or other players in the missions to advance even faster together. So you can actually do the opening campaign to be able to actually have multiplayer join you. All right, let's go click on that. Start a new company. Um... I'm going to probably do USA, but it says your company is located in the scenario you choose. Not only do scenarios look different, but the contracts you can play reflect the different type of construction typical to that region. You can now easily select one scenario and later start a new company in the other one. Okay, so this one we're going to do USA. Okay, now we need a company logo. Oof. Well, I mean, if this was Sam playing this, it would be probably something to do with forestry, like, you know, change. Ah, oh, there, right there, like a saw or something. But since this is not Sam playing, um, let's just do this. Okay. And of course, we got to call it FS Club. Hmm. Call it FS Club Incorporated. There we go. Okay, so set that. Okay, start a single player game. I gotta click on it again. All right, here we go. Let's see how fast it actually takes to load on the PlayStation 5. Now you can fast travel to location you have already. Is it already? Oh, it's about halfway. Now you can fast travel to. Oh, there it is. Okay, one horse town. One summer morning, you woke up in your small hometown. In the distance, the rooftops of a sweltering city flash in the light of the sun. You vigorously forge plans for leaving this sleepy place as soon, well, as quickly as possible. But there's no escape without money or wheels. Then out of the blue, an old acquaintance gets in touch. It's Hap, the owner of a small local construction company. 
It may look tough on the outside, but his heart's in the right place, and his guidance helps you quickly break into the building industry. So it's time to set off for the venture in the world of self-employed. Okay. Hey, look, even your bell box even says John. Wow. Well, it says the name I picked. Okay. And the graphics on the PlayStation 5 are amazing. Okay, so move the camera with that. Okay, move it. Okay. So that's how you walk. You walk kind of slow. Can you run? Oh, yeah. There you go. Follow the markers to speak with Hap. Hey, Hap. I'm on my way. All right. Speak with Hap. Ah, good to see you again. Your active help is most welcome. I'm having a tough time keeping up with all the work. Do you know how many people around here are frustrated and thinking of moving away? If things keep going like that, this place could become a ghost town. To make matters worse, the water supply broke down this morning. It seems there's a crack in the pipeline. So if you want to help give people here another chance, let's fix the water line first. Get in your tractor and go to the local building supply store. You'll find a new pipe section there ready for pickup. Just follow the navigation to get there. In the meantime, I'll head to the pipeline and take a closer look at the damage. Okay, so there we go right there. Okay, so we got to enter the tractor. Oh yeah, I think I actually fixed the echoing that was actually happening with the player when he's talking. So, hopefully it's fixed. Alright, let's go over here real quick. Let's get into our truck. This looks so different than the old construction uh, simulators. Okay. Drive and brake with RT and LT and use L to steer. Okay. Oh, there's no... Th Hold on, let me... Okay, that's to change the view. Oh, there's no actually like, you know, looking around with the R stick. Okay, let's go ahead and yield. So how am I supposed to look around to see if anybody's coming? Oh God, this is going to be terrible. Is there any way I could change this to miles per hour? Let's see. Um, Traffic density. Oh, you can actually change the... Oh, on high, traffic offenses are on. Train a speed unit. Oh, there we go. Let's change it over two miles per hour. Uh, easy economy. Wow, there's actually a lot of options on this. Okay, since that is fixed, I changed it over two miles per hour. But what is the speed limit? Oh, it looks like you actually have to repair vehicles and stuff. If you look over there in the right-hand corner, Looks like there is a wrench, fuel. I think the other one's cruise control, maybe. I don't know what the top one is. Maybe like a fill meter. Okay. Stop. Stop. I see. I The bad thing is I cannot. Yeah. There's no way to look over. There probably is. I just don't know what it is. Is there like a turn signals? Okay, so back up close to the trailer. Press X to couple with it. Oh, wait, there's a help menu right there. Okay, tractors, semi trailers, locations. Oh, okay, that doesn't really help out. Okay, how am I supposed to reverse? I guess just do this. Come on, a little bit more. A little bit more. There we go. Okay, tractors combined with semi-trailers are suitable for a wide variety of transport projects. Depending on what it is to be delivered, a specific semi-trailer must be selected. You must therefore consider whether you need a cargo trailer, a bulk trailer, or a machine trailer for the transport. Multi-trailers can carry both vehicles and cargo on the loading area. All right, does it also say, let me see, oh, there's controls right there. Okay, let's see. Throttle, brake, menu, map. Quick selection, steering, camera mode, switch camera. Oh, that's the distance. Okay, so there is a different one. Context, function, okay. And construct, okay. Let's see if this actually works. 
Oh, look at that. Yes. So much better. But when you drive, it goes back. That's weird. Oh, there we go. Now it's back. Yeah, but it does go back. You have to actually click on it again. Okay, so it's clear. Okay, make a wide turn. Come on. Oh, you see even the like dirt from there? Okay, sorry about that. There was actually a train going by my house. Yeah, see, look at the dirt. That's neat. I gotta switch the camera over. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. You guys did not see that. Okay. Look at that. Beautiful. Perfect. Ooh, that's a busted pipe right there. I did keep the music on this because hopefully it's not copyrighted. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be using an LTM. Uh, so leave the construction machine with that. Okay, so now we get to go into here. Okay, now what does that say? Switch something. Okay, mobile cranes are used on construction sites or on the road to lift heavy loads to elevated positions. In addition to their impressive maximum working height, mobile cranes are characterized by their flexibility and on-site use. The mobile crane can be placed wherever it is needed, independent of a crane area. Tip, switch between driving mode and function mode by selecting it from the context menu. Okay, so we got to go here, go to... Let's see. Can't, oh, change mode right there. Oh, that's cool. Okay. In the manual, you can find all the information about this construction machine. You can also show and hide an overview of the controls. Oh, okay. So, if we hold it down. Look. There it is. Okay, that's nice. All right. You got the cameras. Lift crane up and down. Rotate. See, and then you can also do like this. And it can actually, I love this guide right here. Nice guide. Yeah, we don't need no guide, right? Okay. So. Uh, so we're going to try to get this. Okay. Uh, extract. I got this. Don't worry, guys. Oops. Okay, how do I attach this? Camera, rotate. Okay, is there a button I gotta do? Oh, there it is. Okay, now what? Oh, X, okay. Okay, lift crane up is like that. And now I guess we are putting it over here. Okay, don't wanna be swinging this thing everywhere though. Okay, better extend this thing. Is this as far as it extends? Oh, there we go. Come on. Look at that. Perfect. Okay, now we need to get this one. Oops. Ah, oh, right there. And you know what? Actually, hold on. We're going to check and look at something real quick. Jump down from over here. What's this? A golden hammer. Such collectibles are hidden all over the game world and are just waiting to be discovered by you. Okay. It's just so different, you know, you can actually explore on foot. We've never had that in a construction simulator game. And then you dude can run for a while. All right, let's go ahead and finish up this job real quick. Is there any way that I can just, yeah, just. All right, there we go. All right, so let's go ahead. Oops, no, wrong one. 
Need to bring that in a little bit. Oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, there. Very good, you're a, nat you're a natural. I've been trying to tell everybody this. Now get back to the tractor and take the broken pipe to the scrapyard. It's time it's in the building something then just disappeared. I'll put this thing back, don't worry. There we go, and what is it? This and this. So I'll put everything back to where I got it. Okay, there we go. All right, so you can actually just hold this down and it'll get rid of those controls right there. Oh, actually, that's controls too. Then do that. Okay. Hey, look, it looks like fertilizer from, you know, a uh, farming simulator. All right. Dispose of the damaged pipe. Oh, this turning is gonna be fun. So far, I am really, really surprised about this game. I just, I can't see anything. Oh, there you go, that's a little bit better. Oh, look at even the dirt that goes onto the road. You see that? Yeah, so this is 77% done. Is there like, oh, yeah, there is a clock. It's 1500 right now. So I wonder if there's gonna be like, you know, rush hour or stuff like that. Like, I don't know what the speed limit is. I don't see a speed limit sign. I guess just try to go as fast as we can to get there. I guess so. I was saying it only goes like, what, 55, looks like? All right. We got a stop sign. All right, so I got to bring this into here. Building yard discovered. All right, let's get out of here and let's talk to him. Hey, Hape. I'm relieved. Thanks to your quick action replacing that broken piece, the water supply is repaired and back on. Good job. Since we're finished here, maybe you could give me a hand with something else. Old Joe owns a rundown motel on the outskirts of town. I've been promising him for a while that I would do some renovations on the place. Be a good fella and drive the flatbed truck over there. I'll follow behind and tell you what needs to be done. Okay, so it looks like we gotta take this real quick over to old Joe's. That's me calling Joe old. Follow the markers to reach your destination. See, I think this right here is the opening campaign. It's kind of like a you know like a tutorial about the game. Cause I don't see no speed limit things. Think like this thing ain't unlocking over there. Bye bye. Did you just honk at me? Okay, it's right over here. It looks like we're gonna be helping fix up a old hotel. Oh wow, yeah, no kidding. Look at that. All right. All right, so speak with Hape. I wish there was a way you can like, you know, be able to turn on and off the engine not instead instead of the automatic start. All right, here we go. Old Joe wants us to pretty up his forecourt a little. I don't foresee any big problems. Joe's also been after a new sign on the motel roof for a while now. Something that travelers can see clearly from the highway. As it happens, there's a hotel in town that's about to be torn down. That sly fox Joe picked up the neon sign letters cheap, and a crane operator on the construction site opposite owes me a favor. Drive by there later to pick up the letters. 
But first, let's take care of the forecourt. I have a roller ready for you, so get in and start compacting. Okay, so I guess let's start compacting. Okay, there's the roller. Okay. All right, looks like we get to roll this all out. Okay, this should be interesting. Uh, let's see. Position the roller as straight as possible on a surface and open the context menu to activate the compact compacting function of the construction machine and then work your way forward lane by lane. Stop compacting again via the context menu tip. It is up to you whether you draw your tracks forward or backward. So we're doing, I think it's soil. All right, so let's go ahead and get this thing started. Started. This is going to be interesting right here. Okay, let me get the camera right. Come on. There we go. Okay. So now we go to context menu and compacting. Okay. So now it's on. Looks like you got about three miles an hour when you're compacting. gonna go straight for right now okay, almost to the end okay, there we go turn it off I got stuck on a bush I think I was stuck on a bush actually yeah see time's not even moving right now so yeah, I think this this is will be like a little tutorial about the game. Okay. Get this thing positioned right. There we go. A little bit forward. Come on. A little bit. Right, there we go. Okay, now let's turn compacting on. There we go. We're at 42% already. Fifty-two. Right, there we go with that. You know, let's turn on the rotating beacons. You definitely tell, like, you know, where I've been and not. Come on, back up. Yeah, I can't wait to actually start playing this with multiplayer. Probably going to have Kenny on some episodes. Since I am playing this on the PlayStation 5. Come on. There we go. Reverse a little bit. All right, go forward. What are we at right now? 64. Seventy. Okay. So seventy-nine percent. I'm gonna go over here and do this one real quick. It's a little bit side right over here. I don't think I did that bad of a job. Compacting turned back on. Eighty. Okay, so we're ninety one percent. We're almost done. Probably runs that bush again. 92. I got to do a little bit over there, I bet. Four. 
95. Yeah, see, 96. So we're going to have to do a little bit. But look how much better it looks. It already looks better. We also have to get what? They said a neon sign. That we probably got to pick up from somewhere. There we go. Okay, so that is done. Now let's turn off the beacons real quick. All right, so now we get to go into the flatbed. Hey, he must have moved my truck for me or something. So let's go here now drive to the monument hotel and get the letters so we can remount them here this is going to be fun see you later okay the curb check okay how far away is this area 1300 it's going to take us a minute to get there i guess we can just take a look at the town i guess while we're doing this uh, wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, so here is the map right here. So we're going all the way to right right there, the tower crane. Let me see actually how big this map is. Actually, it is a pretty decent size. Wow. Okay, so we're about finally there. And look at the downtown area. This is neat. Got a highway up there. Yeah, this is a lot. Di oh, red light. Come on, green. And I'm not going to lie. On the way here, I did hit something. So I don't think any of this stuff is like working right now as this is probably the tutorial. Uh, so no repair, no fuel. I know you do have to refill your vehicles finally. Is this thing ever going to turn green? The heck was that? Is that someone like going by blast in their music? Did I ever turn green? That's red. That's green. Wow, these are actually like real traffic lights. They're actually going to take a minute. Oh, there we go. Finally yellow. Come on, go green. That's weird. Actually goes from red to yellow to green. Where I'm at it, they actually go from red to green, and then, you know, green to yellow, and then to red. Uh, school slow. Oh, I gotta go through here. Okay, so let's stop right over here. Do I gotta use this big crane to get this sign down? Wait, am I going to be... There's no way I could, I'm going to be carrying that sign, right? No. No, 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 no. That thing's not going to fit on there. No. <laughs> okay, but anyways, guys, that is going to be the end of this episode. So next time when we come back, we're going to be uh, picking up one of these signs somewhere. And going to be taken over to the hotel to finish that job. Remember, if you guys did enjoy this video, a like would be appreciated. Also, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that sub button and ring that bell. Well, have an awesome day, guys. I will talk to you guys later. Peace.